Good morning, Shama stars. In previous presentation of Chapter Twelve, Biotechnology and its applications, we discussed about genetically modified organisms. In this presentation, we will be talking about pest-resistant plants. Pest-resistant plants are developed by using biotechnological processes. RNA interference is a gene silencing mechanism. triggered by providing double stranded rna that when ingested into insects can lead to death or affect the viability of the target pest transgenic plants expressing double stranded rna version of insect specific target genes are the new generation of resistant plants a nematode melidogyne incognita infects the roots of tobacco plants which reduces the production of tobacco transgenic tobacco plant was protected from the parasite by a process based on rna interference which is possessed by all eukaryotic organism as a method of cellular defense there is a nematode specific gene which is very important for the parasite double stranded rna binds and prevents translation of mrna that is silencing the source of this complementary rna could be from an infection by viruses having rna genomes or mobile genetic elements that replicate via an rna intermediate Agrobacterium vectors are used to introduce nematode specific genes into the host plant. It produces both sense and antisense RNA in the host cells. These two RNAs are complementary to each other and forms a double stranded RNA or dsRNA that initiate RNAi that is RNA interference and hence silence the specific mrna of the nematode the parasite cannot survive in transgenic host expressing specific interfering rna the transgenic plant thus gets itself protected from the parasite so this is how the pest resistant plants are developed by using biotechnological processes you can see the diagram which is shown in this slide roots of typical controlled plants and transgenic plant roots 5 days after deliberate infection of nematode but protected through novel mechanism so children this is all about applications of biotechnology in agriculture i hope you must have understood in next presentation we will be discussing about biotechnological applications in medicine Thank you Shams stars that's all for today you can drop your queries on Google Classroom take care